right, welcome back. We continue right here on the Allegheny Health Network. Now, the sports call, 412-575-2600. Bob Pompiani, Paul Zeiss. We have Brad in Duncansville. Hey, Brad, how you doing? Good, Bob. Hi, um, um, Paul, how are you? I'm good. Uh, another catfish on the ice. Good. I'm good. <laughs> hey, that's what I was going to I have a few penguin points and a pirate question, if I can put it in. Go ahead. Um, the Penguins played an awesome game tonight, and I think the Penguins are going to wrap it up in six on Sunday. And what's up with the catfish turn on the ice? And the, will the Pirates make big moves at the deadline, or are they going to make small moves? No, Pirates won't make hardly any moves. I don't. I don't think. I think they'll be sellers, Bob. Don't you? Yeah, I could see them moving and, Watson. And I could see them get, moving okay, McCutcheon. What are they get? Well, I'm just saying, I could see them moving some guys. I think I don't, I don't think I think they'll be sellers and not buyers. Yeah, I agree. But uh, the bottom line is, by then it'll be all said and done. I, I, I see no scenario under which they can get themselves in this bad division. Do you? Well, I mean, I think they've got good young players. But here's the issue: I don't think Tyler Glass now will become anything more than what he really is right now. Maybe a little better by the end of the year. You know what I'm saying? Um, I can't believe Yvonne Nova is going to go a whole season playing at the level he's playing at. I just can't. You know what I mean? Right. Uh, he's got to have a little counter. Right, the other exactly. Way. Cole, whoever, Williams, Garrett, I mean, Chad Cole, Williams, whoever it is that's going to be in that other spot, I think they're nickel and dimer. So I think it's, you know, it's going to be rough because I don't know that they have the pitching. Yeah, and that's going to be the key. If you can't get Garrett Cole on track, now Tyone may come up and be your saving grace at least. And if you had him, Nova, and Cole all clicking, that's a pretty decent starting three. But if you don't have any of that, uh, you know, then what do you really have? And, you know, their bullpen has been so erratic, especially at the back end of it. You had an interesting column about what the Pirates should do. Why don't you share that about in their bullpen? What would you do? Well, I said I would bring Stephen Brault up. You're going to get Tyon back probably next year, next week. So you have Tyon and Brault. You bring Chad Cole and Trevor Williams. Put them in your bullpen. Now all of a sudden, Clint Hurdle would have Nicasio. Cole and Williams to try and get from the sixth inning to the eighth or ninth, and then you've got obviously Rivero to close games out until Watson and, and Hudson can figure some things out. Yeah, and they need to. What would you do with Tony Watson right now? I would have removed him two weeks ago from. The I ball. would put him on the fake DL. You know, he's tomorrow. I say his arm. What do they say? Arm fake, tightness, fake or DL. you know, Seven, you know ten, day. ten day arm tightness. Send him with Ray Searage and see if he can figure some things out, and then you know, go from there. I just think that's more of a product of the ninth inning, which is a different animal for a lot of pitchers. I don't think Watson looks very comfortable nor confident in the ninth inning, and, and that's when you have to be at your very best that way. Yeah, I mean, there is that, but there are some things going on with him physically, too, um, that he's not making pitches that he generally will ma would make, and there's some people that think he's been overworked. So, I mean, there's a lot going on that's more than just the mental part of it. All right, Penguins have made it official. It's 6 nothing final. They had a five-minute major at the end because of Colton Sissons. It looked like he really bloodied uh, Ole Matta's nose. Uh, and that got really chippy in the third period, as we suspected, Paul. But as far as carryover, I don't see – I never did. I never liked that hockey. We'll go out and do that in the third period, and it'll help us in game six. How will it help you in game six? Uh, it's just, you know, basically frustration. That's all it is. And the thing about it is, is you know, these series are long. You're playing the same guys every game. You know what I mean? Uh, you're banging heads with the same guys every single game. These series get long. There's frustration. You know, the Predators were hoping they could come here and steal a game, and they, you know, really, they got blown out of the building. All right, we're due for a break. Penguins win. They're one win away from winning another Stanley Cup. Back-to-back -back first time in the salary cap era. We'll be back right after this.